All right, good morning. Good morning. My name is Kola Adibai. Um, today we're going to be talking about ads. These are the three devices you can use to run Facebook ad. You can decide to use Facebook. You can decide to use uh, ads manager. It's called ads manager. This is the way it looks like. It tends to give you more details about your ads. All right. Um, this ad will connect with all pages that you and I run as a company. You know, you're going to see all the pages that uh, you run here. And you're going to be able to monitor your ad. You're free to download them. It's called Facebook Ad. Another you can use is Page Manager. Facebook Page Manager, where you can always change to the page of your choice all right so easily if you boost anything here it gets more easier to just click on the boost button and yes let's experiment this let's experiment this let's experiment this experiment this i click on the boost button you see this is it. this is it this is it so let's sit down with it. this is where the work is if you look at the hope here it's telling us um before now i've linked my whatsapp my whatsapp number to hit but if you have not it is in this same column that you click on this once you click on it you'll see different options you click on send whatsapp message after clicking on send whatsapp message it will request for your whatsapp as soon as you provide your whatsapp number a message will be sent to you on whatsapp let me look for the message they sent to me on whatsapp the day i did it let me look for it whatsapp whatsapp that should be facebook facebook this is the message they sent to me on whatsapp the day I did it, you're going to get this message. Uh, you just need one of these code to confirm. That's all. Um, the WhatsApp is integrated to it. So when you run an ad, you get a WhatsApp notification. I want to leave. So I don't want to change anything. Then there are different goals of setting ad. It can be divided into two, which is get more engagement, get more message. If I'm linking my WhatsApp to it and I want them to come to my WhatsApp, I'll choose the option of get more message. And the moment I click on get more message, I've integrated my WhatsApp with it. Cannot be changed after an ad begins. Yes, I don't want it to be changed. You can be able to send, give me a mail or give me a WhatsApp chat, which is very important. And I want you to use get more engagement so that your button option can be sent WhatsApp message. Save. Look at it now. Let me see if I can preview. Okay. I'm trying to see if I can preview it. It's more interesting that you run ads on the system. But this a good way to start. I'm still going to give you an elaborate, elaborate class on system. On audience, you click on edit. This is where the mental work starts. This is where so many people fail. Alright, you choose address. You can decide that I just want people in five kilometers away from me to get this information. You can see this is Lagos, this is aggregate, this is 11 millimeter away. You see, I'm almost covering the whole of Lagos now by just changing it. So I can sit down in an event and say, I want people within this hall to see this ad. Boom. And click on it and start asking me questions. And I'll tell them, ah, we're in the same hall. Can we meet outside? Blah, blah, blah. That's something for you. If you come on that region, you select age. I'm going to give an elaborate class on how to select age and all of that, as well as gender. I'm just showing you the practical aspect. I want to cancel. I want to cancel it because I don't have an how to run right now. 
you can also save audience. I have a number of audience in this account. Which are limited. I do not, you know, these are things I've done in the event wedding towards uh ABS should be uh, yeah, this, this one is politics, yeah, it's politics. Politics, people, matches, server, public, you, know, you see, you see, government, policy, and all that, that's politics. Alright, I've had stuff to do with the um, Lagos photographers in the past. Uh, you can choose people who like your page, choose true targeting. Uh, you need to be deliberate by your audience. We're going to talk about that. Then, this is where you set your budget. I told you, one dollar is possible, the minimum budget. It's one dollar per day. Please increase your budget. So if I decrease this to one day, it has removed. It is because it's on more than one day. That's why I've seen this information. I want it to run one day, and I say spend one dollar. One dollar is not hard to one k. Ladies and gentlemen, if you want this ad to run on Instagram, you see, and then I click this. It's not going to run on Instagram. See the way it's going to look on Instagram. Sometimes I even want my heart to run on Instagram alone. Because Instagram has a way of giving you more sales, more money compared to other social media platforms. And this is how it's going to look on Instagram. This is how it's going to look on Instagram. Alright. If I'm not okay with it, I can decide I don't want it to run on Instagram. Obviously, with the dimension of these graphics, I don't want to do it to run on Instagram. Alright, that's all. Payment method, you had your payment. You can always add another payment. Um, I've had my home payment. My home payment method is different because when I started, the option I believe now is not available. On that payment, when you click on it, they will ask you to provide your your the ATM details and all of that. All right, I, I advise you to use um, GT to use Access. I've used Access, Echo Bank, and um, Wema Bank is working. Uh, Polaris Bank and um, First Bank is working. Zenith Bank is working. UBA is working. So you just make sure you use and you click on boost. Once you click on boost, you have to be under review for 24 hours. You can get back to you before 24 hours. That's good. Alright. Another thing you should watch out for is that the text on your the words on your heart should not be much. Try to be in control of it. Make it something minimal. Make it something minimal. And it's your responsibility now to begin to observe every Facebook ad you see. Every Facebook ad you see is telling you something. You will see the people that get it right, you will see the people that got it wrong. So it's your responsibility now. I've done justice to that. I'm going to drop a link to how do you select the right audience. That's number one. Number two. Uh, I think that's all we talk about. And if there's any other thing I need to share with you, I'm going to share with you after this class. Thank you very much. I love you. Have a nice day.